right guys, first stop, pulled off the highway. What are the odds? And they're hot. It's piss. Not today guys, not today. Back on the road, donut disaster averted. Veggie egg white patty and ham. And fun fact, this is what a small looks like when you're almost out of the States. Actually small. Alright, we gotta drive. But I, I think, you know, with Kai out of the show, that's that's probably uh, puts him uh, in a head to head contest with Sean Roden. And it's, you know what, I've always told Sean that. Yes! <laughs> Let's do this. Are you ready for your first Denny's yeah. experience? Ready for yeah. Go for it. Alright guys, so initial impression of Denny's in Canada. Egg white quality is way better. Everything's way better. They cook the egg whites properly. What'd you get? Blueberry pancakes, buttermilk, a cup of just fruit, yeah. and then egg whites and turkey bacon. The fruit's way upgraded. So we're gonna black coffee. We're gonna eat all this and catch you guys in the gym. Crush. So this workout was started off with deadlifting. I found a really good gym in the area called uh, Torque Barbell Club. Pretty much like a powerlifting style gym with a lot of, uh, I don't know, different like strongman type stuff. So just a very versatile gym. But the bar I was pulling with was really, really stiff. It was it's like a standard silver bar, but it had no give, um, unlike the black bars that other people were squatting with. And uh, I was a little worried, four or five, felt really heavy and I didn't think I was going to get that many reps but I decided to just pull as much as I could and I was able to get 12 reps so really not trying to get too uh, technical in these workouts was just trying to find a good gym get my workouts in and that was that so after the deadlifting went to leg press I ended up doing 45 reps on my top, top set with five plates on each side which was kind of crazy that felt really really good I've never used that leg press before they're always different but that's what felt good, so I just went for it. Same with quad extensions, did a couple uh, very intense sets, as with the ham curls, and 
finished the leg portion of the workout off with uh, just some heavy good mornings, something I haven't done in a while. So I worked up to 225 and just did one top set of five reps. Had more in the tank, but between deadlifting with the stiff bar for 12 and doing leg press to like ridiculous failure, I was chilling. So um, that was pretty much every exercise for the leg workout. I stretched after for a while, but finished off with calves. I didn't have a seated one. So I just got in a few heavy calf raises and that'll be that for the leg workout. Again, just quick workout clips here. Uh, that's it, hope you enjoyed it. Just pulled out of the gym and um, about to get some protein bars, but it ain't good. Deadlift PR on the stiff bar, so let's do something quick. It's cold as shit. Right. Turkish bread? Turkish bread. Non. Too much good shit. Alright. Post workout meal. Just left the gym. It's actually right over there. Hit this place called Gym's No Frills. And got some tuna, it's 30 grams of protein in this can. Strong, different portion than in the States. Little whole wheat bread, blueberries, raspberries, pineapple, bananas. Splitting it. Maybe 70 30, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I think so, 70. But it's going down. Leave the best for last. <laughs> the game changer. <laughs> You gotta try it. 10 out of 10. On this day, I just needed to get in and get out because I had to leave Toronto. There was like a blizzard coming. So it is like an eight hour drive. Got this workout in the morning and then dipped out quickly after. So just hit uh, this bar I've been wanting to use. I've been dying to try this bar. Uh, I see Branch Warren, I think, using it all the time. I'm not sure what it's called, but you guys can see it perfectly. It's just like a various uh, neutral grip with bar. Not sure if it weighs 45 or 55 pounds. It felt pretty heavy, but that could just be having never done it before. So did a couple sets with 225, or what I thought was 225, may have been a little bit more. And then uh, worked up to heavy rows, 225 here. As you can see, I'm really working the, uh, the negative, where I'm trying to stretch and get really parallel on that starting position, just to fry my lats a bit. And that was uh, the two main compounds for the uh, for the workout really. I hit some hammer strength chest press after, a couple sets of chest flies, and then just did a couple arm workouts, arm exercises, nothing too fancy, but um, I'm gonna bring you guys some more workout footage soon before I head back to Miami, but that's it. Just wanted to give you guys a couple clips while I was in Toronto, Toronto and uh, yeah, the gym was actually pretty badass, so hope you guys enjoyed it. Post-workout Chipotle. Alrighty guys, just got the Chipotle in, heading to the border. That's a wrap for a quick Toronto detour, and then it's off to, well then I'm back off to New York. I think I'm driving through a snowstorm, so that's gonna be something else, but hope you guys enjoyed the little vlogging that I did, but I'm thinking of shooting some legit footage at the East Coast Mecca coming next week, so stay tuned, bros, thank you. All right. Back in the US, safe-ish and sound. First thing to report, we got a Denny's. I do have to get a meal in after that little potle bowl, but I'm gonna save it. It's time to diet more. Cheat day soon.